No jumper, coolest podcast in the world, man. We're back again with a recurring guest, man, <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Gerald. Wait. Hudson or Huston? Houston. No, it's Houston, man. Houston, Everybody say my name wrong. It's I Houston. call you Hudson, right? Why? Because I went to high school with a kid called Dante Hudson. Okay. And he spelled it exactly like your name, bro. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> That's not I'm Dante Houston, Hudson, bro. bro. I'm Houston. It's Houston. Houston. Everybody say my name wrong, man. Was he funny? Was Dante Hudson funny? He wasn't even funny. Listen, man. Dante was a light skin with a curly tie who got all the Okay. Hey. Okay, okay. I hated that man. Oh, man. Shout <laughs> out to hey, that sound man. I despise that <laughs> you feel me? Okay. Right? Like that, yeah, hey, no. I Wait, and how did you know, like, how to pronounce the name? I I, I pronounced he it, said wrong it wrong earlier. Too. Yeah, no, he no. said it wrong. Oh, he, really? He texted to me wrong, so Hudson. you know what I mean. No, wait, 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 no, wait, no, wait. I, I, I typed it H U T S O N. H U S T O N, yeah. H-U- no, he put H U T. Oh, Houston. Oh, it's Houston. 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 Duh. H-U-S-T. Yeah. Duh. Man, yo, listen, like, well, so we got my boy Prim here. What's up, y'all? Now, Prim is the stand-up comedian offic- aficionado. Okay. That's not true. I mean, yeah, no, low-key, low low-key. Low he, he I'm like the Simon up. Cowell. Right? Yeah, I don't do it, but, you know. No, I mean, he tried it. Tried it. <laughs> did, you, did you bomb? And, and, uh, low-key, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah bomb, it's not. I did. What joke you tell when you bomb? What well, every, you I mean, I just kept forgetting the jokes. That's what the problem was. But everybody, <laughs> like, because I have a lot of comedian homies, so, like, Everybody knew it was gonna be my first yeah. time, and everybody, you know, what I mean, I mean, everybody. Like that was the point of the show. Like I think the theme of the show was like they were telling all their first sets or whatever, and like the jokes that they were bombing with for their. It was like a first time type of theme, so it wasn't that bad that I bombed. But yeah, I wasn't. I got to bring a notepad or something oh, next okay. time, man. That's tough, bro. Yeah, but you shout quit out to y'all, though. Man. Why'd you shout quit? Out to y'all. I didn't quit. Bro. Like you, man, stop, bro. Like wait though, like you haven't like done it since though. Well, I mean, I think so I you only did I, it one time. Yeah, yeah. And you quit. You well, did it one time and you quit. I have a lot of other stuff going on. Man, you ain't got no heart, bro. You ain't got to have heart. <laughs> I have heart. Got terrified. But yeah, even still, yeah. like even if I would have did good, I don't think I would have liked it. You know what I mean? It's I'm more of like a I gotta sit and craft my. Shit, you know what I mean? Like I can't just be up there. You know what I mean? Wow. It's see, exchanging with people. You know, I don't know. You see, it's hey, listen, right? So it's a lucky, vibe, right, man? It's just, it's tough. I might get back up there again, man. Everybody's trying oh. to get me back up there. You should. I though. got some. I got some decent Prim. jokes. You know what I'm saying? Hey, tell, tell one. Let me hear one. Yeah, if yeah, yeah. tell him. <laughs> you want me to tell yeah, a joke tell now? Joke. Yeah, tell a joke. Is you my, have an actual successful comedian here to give you advice? Okay, all right. Take so, advice. All right, so I have a, I have a joke here. I'm not going to go through the whole joke, uh, uh, but. This is yeah. based on a true story. I have a joke where uh, I went, through, on, dude, we I went on a gay date yeah. one time, and so uh-huh. hold on, bro. You said so, you went on a gay date? Yeah, pause. With a gay person? Yeah, I didn't. I didn't. It wasn't. They set me up or whatever. Gay guy, yeah. or gay girl. It was a dude. It was a gay dude. Tell the full joke though, for me, because we got time. I'm gonna tell it. the joke. Okay, so, tell the joke. So the full one. I'm not gonna. I don't have the whole structure of it. Uh, right? uh, 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 okay. But just the structure. So how it goes is, I'm like. We we're we're going home from like a party. You tell it like this on stage. I, I bet I'm you not did, doing something like this on the stage. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm like, I don't have it on the. I don't have it. Yeah. So basically, all right, we t- we taking too much time with this. So no, listen, so we got no time. No, no, we want to hear. I wanna so hear. the we joke talk. is, we all driving home from a, a, a party. Me and my coworkers, mm-hmm. and one of my coworkers is like, "Hey, bro, we got the after party at my place." Yes, and I'm like, "What's well, gonna be there?" He's gonna be like, "It's gonna be drinks, everything." Mm-hmm. So this is based on a true story too. Uh, okay. So we get to the house, and he takes us down to the basement. It's just me and him. We go down to the basement, mm-hmm. and it's like a steel chair and like a TV. Yeah. And like a bed. It's like a f- jigsaw trap in that. Mo- a dungeon. So, yeah. And so I'm like, "Hey, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, where's the? B-? Yeah. And he's like, "You the? B-? Ah. <laughs> nah, I don't know. Boo. I'm the b-. That was a joke. <laughs> that was ass. Yeah. That was, that was terrible, bro. No. You, I don't know where you're That's crazy. That's funny. That's nuts. I don't know where you're going with that. Yeah, yeah. This man know. said, you the. Hey, man. Y'all made me tell the damn joke. And you know, y'all. Really <laughs> so that's when before. you bombed. When you told it, though, you bombed? No, I didn't tell that one. I told, oh, okay. I told a similar one. But yeah. Oh, okay. Either way, yeah, it's not for me, bro. It's not for everybody. Yeah, that was no, wait, wait, no, wait the. But like, that's, but like, that's why, like, okay, but like, that's the thing, right? It is for him, right? Like he's like a natural, like anti enthusiast. I just type told of the comedian, joke. right? <laughs> that was him, into like a personality, right? I right? guess, yeah, yeah. I guess it's gotta be. You feel me, you right? Like I an anti enthusiast. You feel me, right? Like real bland, real like monotone. 
You feel me? Right, like, right, kind of just like, just like, lead us into the joke, like, like, you know, like, you know, like, by like accident. You feel me? I right. mean, you're a funny dude. You think you could do that? No, man. Up? Listen. So, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Me, well, no. It's not for yeah, everybody. It's not for everybody. Yeah, it's not for it's everybody. Not for everybody. Bro. Bro. Hey, bro, but he said though, something like real important. Like, and he said, uh, this is a true story, too, right? Now, yeah. I'm not sure if you've heard about like the Hassan Manjari scandal, where it's kind of like. No, I heard that. So, he was telling jokes, right? Where like it included, you know, like how the cops like stopped him one time and brutalized him in, in Ontario. Mm -hmm. How like a girl invited him to prom, then like he got there and she was with somebody else, right? So he was telling like yeah. these real sophisticated jokes, right? So the New Yorker was supposed to interview him, but but again, but but the New Yorker fact checks everything, meaning like like these don't miss a beat. Uh, mm. So while preparing for their interview with him. They was fact checking all of his stories and came back like, bro, all this is fake. So then, like, they did like a piece on him, right? So now people are saying he's a fraud. So, as a comedian, do you feel like your jokes have to be truthful, or well, uh, do Gerald be lying? I mean, I'll be telling, I'll be telling my my story. I'll be telling true jokes that really happened to me. Yeah, uh, I might like, you know. Uh, Fabricate a little bit of it, yeah, to make it funny. You know what I'm saying? Like, How much of it? Like basically, like what you said. Yeah. If I told that joke, bro, I would have had to tell some, some lies and <laughs> add to the joke. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Like, more, yeah, yeah. It's a true story. But I need to add some lies to the joke. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, he didn't say you the or whatever. Yeah. No. 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 no he didn't so say wait, you the wait. Hold up. What did he say then? It was. It was. It, I'm not. Let's oh. not do this, man. I don't want to talk about this story. It's that's for the draws? Nah, so what? So basically, uh, what happened? No, <laughs> nah, so he was supposed to just like take me home or whatever the f. And we was like chilling, just like drinking some beers or whatever. And then we were like talking about working out. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, I'm trying to fill my fill my chest in. And, yeah. and nigga, <laughs> grab my chest. For it? Why ain't, did he pull his dick out? No, nah, he ain't pull oh, his okay. dick out or whatever. <laughs> grab my chest. Yeah. And it was like, you, and I'm like, nah, don't do that, bro. And he was like, oh, what you don't f around? Yeah. And I'm like, nah, I you don't. Grab your not at all, no. He grabbed it like this. <laughs> no, nah, he like grabbed it like he do like this. You know what I mean? Wait though, and that was the funniest part of the joke though. That's what I mean. I'm there's no joke there though. A exactly the That's point. Just sexual that, harassment. That's bro, a that, joke, bro. That was funny, bro. Like, That's traumatizing. I mean, yeah. Me? If I can package it and you know what I mean, deliver it in a yeah, you got to. I mean, a funny stand up way. You got deliver it, maybe. Man. But yeah, I don't got no time to do all that, man. That's like man. a side hustle, and then that shit don't really. You know, yeah. I mean, that gets you on, but like the the money don't be there. But you know, what I mean, it, it definitely it, gets you on. What kind of lies do you tell though? Like, like, uh, like for example, do you tell like for example, right? Like, like, tell me a joke so that's well, that's okay, a clear like, cut fabrication. All right, so check this out. So clear cut lying. So basically, uh, I got I tell jokes about my son because I got a gay son. You oh, know what I'm saying? My son's so. gay. I support my son. You know, wait, do all that. Yeah, I got a, my son's gay. For real? Yeah, yeah for real. For real. Like, for how real. old is he? He's 15 years old. Okay. About to be 16. How, how did you know he's gay at 15? Bro, you know what you like. Bro, I'm telling you right now, bro. The school yeah. called me. Yeah, the nigga. And they guy. called me one day and they was like, yo, he, he up here twerking. Damn. It's <laughs> like, he up here twerking. That's hilarious. Oh, they that's gay, me, gay. Yeah, they called me and told me. I'm looking like, hold on. You talking, hold on, like, hold on. You talking about my daughter mm -hmm. or my son? I'm like, no, your son up here twerking. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I, when I told a joke, I, I told a joke, like, it really happened like that, but yeah. I kind of changed up everything. You know, I told a joke, I'd be like, uh, I told I told the crowd like yo I got four kids I got three three daughters yeah. and one son mm -hmm. you know and I got custody of my kids I'm a single yeah. dad and I tell them like yo the, the school call me all the time they call me all the time they're like yo your kid up here twerking yeah your kid up here pole dancing your kid up here sexually harassing the boys I'd be like yo that's my son doing all that yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yo so, walk like, me through that though like, right so as a okay so as somebody though like who you you know like you came from the trenches right yeah you was a trench baby right so. Now, being a trench baby, we are not, I guess, the most open-minded and accepting people. You yeah. feel me? So, one, how did you find out that that he was gay, and and how did you like deal with it? Uh, I mean, that's how I found out. Like, when the oh, school called me, yeah, the school yeah. called me, told me this. Uh. You know, I, he came home, said, "Yo, man, is, is you gay?" He was like, "Nah, I mean, I'm asexual." Oh, asexual is you know, crazy. Asexual mean they're not attracted to uh, I get you. to yeah. men or women. What? You know, but it's it's my son. You know what I'm of saying? Of course. So like. I can't, He's not like, gay then, right? Yeah, like I can't beat him. You know, I can't whip. I can't whip it out of him. If I whip yeah. him, he might like it too much. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, wait. <laughs> wait <though. laughs> if he's asexual, then he's not gay, right? He he don't like men. He don't like men. He don't like women. Um, but he said he's gay. He, he's just trying to figure himself uh, out. Ah, you know like, and before you found out though, did you have any inkling like he was like playing with the girls too much? He was. Uh, you know? 
my son got a lot of yeah, sisters. He got, he got oh, brothers, gotcha. you know. And uh, I used to start to like when he grew when he, when he grew up. I tried to correct him and shit, you know. But like, mm-hmm. hey man, you don't do that. You don't talk like the girls. You a boy. You don't do what they do. You do what you do. Yeah, you know. But it seemed like it just it was always that's in him. Anyway, you know that's yeah, how he was. Yeah. I could I couldn't change it. You know what I'm saying? So like man. that's who he is. So I love my son. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah, man. See, like for here, right? For me, it's like for example, right? Like the scariest part for me for having like a, a gay son, right? Is like how do I like coach him through like a heartbreak, right? Right? Like right? Like here, right? So look. I can say, listen, your hoes ain't shit. These bitches are, you feel me? <laughs> Just switch it up, yeah. Uh-huh. Hip it up. <laughs> Go dig in, you feel me? Like, watch your pockets, right? But, like, when dealing with with, with with men, like, what do we say? Like, Yo, man, ain't yeah. shit. Well, I mean, well, I don't know, man. See, I just told him I, I just want my son to be on top. Uh, you know what I'm saying? That's funny. <laughs> yeah, of course. I don't want to be on the bottom. Oh yeah, like, that's uh, yeah, that's different, right? I mean, either way, yeah, it don't. I, I think mean, once, son, you, once you there, I you think you're there, gonna be a player. Right? I think, he, I think he's gonna be a gay player though. I, I think my son gonna be a gay player. He's gonna run through niggas. You know what I'm saying? That's yeah, I think, you know what I'm saying? Like, here, wait though, right? Okay, so then, like, why? So okay, so what about the bottom? Is like, bro, that's. Like that's too far. <laughs> that's too far, my nigga. It's like you your me? son, like he the girl of the relationship. You know oh yeah, saying? that's why you want to be the man in the relationship. You feel me? Because your son on bottom, you gotta yeah. pay for the wedding. Yeah. You, oh, wanna, you don't want to pay facts. for the wedding. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. Your son on bottom, you that's you facts. pay for the wedding. You know what I'm saying? Oh really? Right. Nah, that's crazy, bro. So man, goddamn man, yo. But hey, right. But look, but look, but like since you've been here, man, you've been in some like headlines, man. You feel me? Yeah. One. You are now an official comedian. Right. You are a stand-up comedian now. Yeah. How's that transition been from, like, the online stuff? Right, hey, right, hey, right, 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 right. Cause you, oh, was, you, you know, successfully transitioned? Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's a feat, man. He's a real that's comedian now, like, man. a full-time one now. Yeah, okay, good. that's what's up. So how, so how do it feel, man, to, like, for example, us as, like, on, us as like online creators, like, we get told, like, that's not a real profession, my nigga, Right. You gotta hop in this, you know, world, right? right? Yeah. And, and you finally did it, right? So how do it feel, man? Um, I don't know, man. It's just crazy because like people think I c- I couldn't do it, yeah, because I do internet videos mm-hmm. and like man, all you do is walk up and call people the wrong name or look for lookalikes. Of course, how can you go on stage and be funny? What you gonna do? Talk about tell people who they're gonna look like? Yeah, look like this person. Of course, you know. But like I'm actually like a writer, bro. Like I really yeah. can write jokes. So yeah, you know. Um, before I started doing internet videos, mm-hmm. I had tried to do stand up. You know, I went on stage, I did good sometimes and I yeah. bombed sometimes, but like like I still had the the heart to get up there and do it again. Like let's get up there and get this right. You of know course. what I'm saying? Like so I don't know, man. It's like a good transition for me. Like it was kinda easy cause Hey, how's the money? The money ain't yeah. as good as the internet money. No? <laughs> yeah, no, it's not. That's what I'm saying, man. Wait. The money ain't as good as the internet money. How much they pay you right now, man? Like don't, don't be going to sure. numbers. You ain't gotta go. Man, to numbers, see man. right now I'm on tour with other comedians. Oh so, who? Right now it's me, uh, cheating ass Myron. I don't know if you heard of him or not. No. Kelly Kills and Funny Marco. Okay. So we all. I know Funny Marco. Wait, yeah. hey, he does stand up too? Yeah, Marco's transitioning doing stand up right now. Yeah. Oh, that's hard then. Mm-hmm. Feel me? But hey, now when it comes to touring though, man, feel me? Like we know, know right, that like niggas be scared, man. Right? Yeah. So we just found out about the TK Kirkland and Charleston White shit, right? Oh, uh, yeah, I heard about that. Who was your like reaction to that, right? When like Charleston was saying that he didn't get paid, he got cheated out of, like, like out of his cash. Like, is that normal Man. in like in like in the comedy world? I ain't never got uh, cheated out of what I got. Yeah. I never got cheated out of money. Yeah, um, no, okay. I think only during this tour we've been, we've been about uh, I think we did like probably fifteen cities so far. Yeah, only one city has got us on our money one time. Oh, who? Man, it was Denver. Man, we was in Denver uh-uh. and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> at a comedy club called yeah. Comedy Works in Denver. Yeah. You know, packed out. It was sold out. Yeah. We could see four sold out shows. They said that we only had 20% of the crowd, uh, 20, 20% of the room filled out. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, so a lot and say that shit, bro. Like, but. Damn. Wait, wait, so, wait. So, like, oh, okay, so, like, y'all bomb? Like. No, nah, we didn't bomb. No, nah, y'all came sold, and, yeah, they came. We sold us. We sold the whole room out. Oh, God. They, said they, they came sold way less tickets or whatever. Damn, yeah. we only had 20% of the room filled Oh, wow. I got I got videos and everything and I got videos and everything, bro. That shit like it's now, crazy. hey, now y'all some real niggas though. You feel me? Again, yeah. again, though, again, like they comedians now, but they still, still, still from a Kansas City. You feel me? Yeah. <laughs> so how does some real niggas deal with man? See, <laughs> <as, laughs> nest. You, you let the manager handle all that. Ah, let the manager handle that. And you don't get too much involved with that shit. You know what I'm saying? Because like. Like in my heart, what I wanted to do, like I can't do what I wanted to do. Yeah, that could ruin my relationship with other clubs. Like, yo, he beat up the manager because he didn't get his money. You know, what <laughs> like you don't want to be make that. You don't want to have that. Yeah, up. don't do that. Yeah, yeah. That yo, stigma. 
Listen, right? So, like, oh, yeah, yes, right? So, like, speak about that, though, right? Like, is there, like, kind of, like, a sanctuary in, in, in like, like, in, like, the comedy clubs, right? Like, hey, right? Because uh, I think it was an L.A. comedian who claims he knocked out, like, uh, like, like T.K. Kirkland at the... At the oh, yeah. Right? Yeah, right? Yeah, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, right? And he said, like, he felt bad because the... Cause Cause the comedy shows is going to be like, right, like you know, and it, it's like this like sanctuary of yeah. like peace, where you shouldn't even. Man, they don't, they don't, I don't think yeah. comedy clubs like that. They don't like drama. They don't like yeah, yeah no. that shit. But that shit don't don't make them no money. You know, what makes comedy clubs money is putting butts in the seats. Yeah, good material and no drama. You of know course. what I'm saying? They don't want you fighting and beating up comedians and shit like that. That shit ain't cool. A facts. Like like um, and how prevalent is that though? The Comedian or comedian beefs? Um, I say out of that shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I don't even be around. I done seen. No, I done seen it from the outside. Oh, I see some wild shit. I, in stay, LA. I stay away from that shit, bro. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I haven't really seen like full on beefs, but there is always like a air of competition. You know what I mean? They always bro, what be the, like, like, oh, this stolen? nigga not funny or uh, comedians do be stealing jokes, man. I ain't gonna lie, bro. People be stealing jokes. <laughs> oh wow, they be stealing uh, jokes. But, how do you know though that they stole like right? Like, hey, right? Because listen, because like for example. If I make a YouTube video and somebody else makes the same video, yeah, it's just you know like we just thought about uh, you know about the same, same thing. Shit. But somebody can take your shit word for word. Damn, you know I had somebody take my my joke word for Ooh. word. Mm. A comedian back home in Kansas City. Oh wow, he took my joke word for word and then added something, it. then added something to it. Oh no! And so all I did was just say thanks for adding me that joke. Give me that joke too. <laughs> oh really? That shit was funny. Oh, yeah, that shit was funny, bro. Right, man. I was trying to figure out how to end that joke. You helped me out, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah right. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like you stole my shit, make my shit back. That's oh funny. wait, hold up. So like he made your joke funnier? He didn't make it funnier. He okay. just added another part that I liked. <laughs> you know I mean? Like, hey, you stole his shit too. And I took that shit back. Like here, let me that end part you just said right there mm. and put it in my joke. God damn, have you ever stolen? It? Well, I thought of that though. Have you ever like stolen? You know, jokes from let's say Dave Chappelle or I ain't never stole no joke from nobody. Damn. You know what I'm saying? I just keep, I think of original stuff like, yeah. like out the box. Like some jokes is you can't, you can't like not tell them. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you're telling a joke about cheating. Yeah. A lot of people tell a joke about cheating. Tell a joke about okay. sex. You heard that shit? Like yeah. some of these jokes are hacked. You haven't heard them before. Yeah. But they, they told them from a different angle. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, so like I try not to, I try not to tell hack jokes. Of course. But, you know, there, there are certain jokes that people are going to tell. Like say something happened in the media, like, what happened in media yesterday? Sexy Red, right? She yeah. got her sex hate leak. So it's going to be thousands of comedians mm -hmm. tonight, tomorrow, the this weekend, uh -huh. telling a joke about Sexy Red, pussy getting leaked. You know what I'm saying? Like, Where's she from? Uh, she from St. Louis. Dog. Okay, that makes sense. You yeah. seen that video? Dog. Mm -hmm. and, oh, what's your take on it, man? Man, I think she lied. Her pussy wasn't pink. Well, like, inside got to be pink, <laughs> right? <laughs> Right, somewhere it was somewhere. more like like brown. It was like your color, color you, bro. Yeah, right. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Pause though. Yeah, we like the same color. No, I'm saying, bro, you a little darker than me, bro. Hell nah, a little man. bit. What? A little bit, bro. I mean, like one shade, maybe. It, it, it proves light skin. Not really. No, right? no he not light skin. Like he a like, peanut butter. Yeah. No, yo, not wait, peanut though. butter, bro. You like more like what? Orange. Of granola. I was I would agree orange probably yeah more than like orange. Wait though. So when you watch that tape, right? Is that how like most girls from that side of the world like pussy is? Because I think like Kansas City and, and St. Louis is near each other, man. I don't know, man. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I can't speak for her, man. That shit was kind of that, that tape was kind of whack, though. You seen it, bro? I seen the that tape. That shit was dry, bro. He had to spit on it and yeah. everything, bro. Like. Yo, he, he, bro, he did like a loogie. He spit on that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. they definitely could have uh, did another take or something, man. Yeah, I wasn't fucking with it. How do y'all think, though, like, that's going to affect her career? It's not going to affect her career. Yeah. That's no, what you, she rap about. Yes, right? Yes, right? Hey, right, but look, right, but look. She's so, not, she not going to get a Grammy. Yeah, she's sex not, tapes are regular Grammy, now, too. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, hey, right? No, listen, right? Because, like, cause like, Ice Spice and Glorilla, right? Like, they have been able to cross over into more so, like, the mainstream, right? Right. Her, she don't want to be stuck in the same like niche that Sukiana is stuck in, right? Uh, well, I don't, well, I don't, I don't think, think she, she cares. Was ever, yeah, I don't think she was ever really. She not going, really. to, going to get Ice Spice level. You know what I mean? I don't think. No, she hard as fuck. I mean, she is, but you know, I like her. I like the music, man. She be she be going hard. She tell the truth. She tell her truth. Um, but I think that that's just her who she is, bro. Like she. Yeah. This freaky nasty rapper and that tape ain't gonna affect her. Yeah, they she was never. Yeah, they gonna just talk shit like, and then. 
Ice it's Spice can like it. clean it up a little bit and be like commercially acceptable for white people type of shit. But like Sexy Red can never yeah. clean Spice. Her act up. You can't even compare all. Ice Spice to yeah. Sexy Red though. I don't think she's ever. No. What? Hey, listen. The last six months, she's had like two Billboard hits. You feel me? Right. So it's kind of like who's talking about Sexy Red? Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So right. So like she's on that rise. Right. Feel me? Like uh, and Ice Spice though. Like again, like in her her first video, Munch. Like we all thought, thought you know that she was like this ratchet Sukiana, right? And she crossed over into like the Taylor Swift. I didn't think she was that ratchet though. She wasn't. She I Spice and Sukiana and, and Sexy Red. I think they're a totally different category now, right? Sexy Red and, and Suki in the same category, but they I Spices. She got Dunkin' Donuts commercials, bro. Yeah, that's yeah, she got her own Dunkin' Donuts drink. Yeah, they're like video you know I mean? type of joints. Yeah, like she's up right now, man. You feel me? What kind of drink you gonna make with Sexy Red? Oh, uh, <laughs> Hennessy? Yeah. <laughs> got new cans of Hennessy. What? Malt? Yeah, right? <laughs> nah, listen, like, that's not stuff. No, but either way, I think that was always her plan to be in that lane or whatever. Like, some people aren't going to be able to get Dunkin' Donuts commercials, you know what I mean? Yeah. So. Yo, bro, why do you keep on tricking the internet, man? What you mean? <laughs> what are you talking about? Listen, though, right? Listen, right? So, look, we got beef, right? Because, like, I, I be posting the videos, right? Thinking right. thinking this shit is 100% real. And then, like, it's like a Gerald Hudson. Like, yeah, sorry. Yes. <laughs> a Gerald Houston scenario video, like, where it's kind of like you right. just. And I'll be like, yo, he gets us every time, right? Because, like, mm. his fucking face is not in it. Not in the video. But, but see, it's man, the voice. I'll be, oh, you feel me? Yeah, right? man, like. I, what I discovered was people like to argue on the internet. Yeah. They love to argue. Yeah. They don't care if it's real mm -hmm. or fake. fake. They don't give a fuck. They be like, yo, uh, this video might be fake, but this shit happen all the time. And if mm -hmm. it did happen, it's my think piece on it. You know what I'm saying? People love to argue on the internet, bro. They love to argue. They love to debate. They love that shit. So when I know they love it, I just keep giving it to them. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Plus, them videos make a lot of fucking money. <laughs> a word. That's what's yeah, up. They oh, do. Where? Like on YouTube, TikTok, or everywhere? On Facebook, really. Oh, Facebook, yo. Facebook, man. Yeah, besides YouTube, man, Facebook man, probably pays One video, one of them videos can make you ten to fifty thousand dollars. Uh, uh, wait, the shorts? I gotta get on Facebook. The, long the three minute videos. Damn, really? Three minute videos, man, on Facebook. Oh, wow. I'm telling you. Yo, I, I gotta tap in, bro. You feel me right here, right? Because right now, I think I, 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 I got like a thousand followers, and on, and on, right, but I don't post. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Wait, so, so wait here, right? So let's say this. A video that does a million views like makes you what in, on Facebook? They can pay you between a thousand and three thousand, if not more. It depends on oh, how okay. long the video is. Mm -hmm. It depends on uh, how long people watch the video. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, uh, I've got a video that got forty million views. Video that made me one hundred fifty thousand mm. dollars. You know what I'm saying? What? Like, That's fine. Yeah. Like forty million. Forty. It was actually it was a video. Yeah. I mean, I've been living on this video for like three years, bro. It was a video <laughs> in the, uh, the DNA video. When I had a girl watching this to the singing, I gave her the, the, uh, the DNA results. I said, this baby ain't mine. You that know? was you! Oh, yeah. I remember that. Yo! Yeah. Hey, yo, he keeps tricking us, bro. <laughs> yeah. I posted that video, and it was a think piece. Right. People, they write long scenarios, engage in it. When they get to That's arguing, cold, they get to arguing like, man, this is what, how, how you know this? You know, they get to arguing and shit, bro. Like, so how, yeah, how do you come up with scenarios or what are, like what is um, your what do you be getting inspired by? Man, I don't know, man. Just like real life situations. Man. Like the last one I did, I had a uh, last one I did. I was in a poly relationship and I had two girls <laughs> and they was at the nail shop and I was like, yo, if y'all don't move in with me, I ain't paying for your nails no more. Y'all gotta move in with me, both of y'all. Mm -hmm. And they both arguing like, girl, I move in. She's like, I don't want to move in. And they arguing and stuff. So yeah. people like that type of shit, bro. They like drama, bro. So mm -hmm. how you like, find the actors or whatever? You just be like, just girls that are on the internet. Okay, just yeah. just girls that I be, <laughs> you know, you slide the DMs. Be like, hey, schedule you it. Like, it be, it'd be like girls that I've already like. Cause I, I did a lot of videos where I did like uh, pickup lines and shit like that or whatever, getting girls numbers, and then so like I just hit them up like, yo, you want to do a video with me, you know, stuff like that, you know. That's you want to go viral? Like, like, oh yeah, I go viral. So like a lot of them like they still cool with me to this day, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, cool yeah, girls. bro, like yo, bro, like he be listen, bro, like like in the last one like that we're like talking about like bonkers was that one, and then it was the I flew you out, bitch. Oh yeah, fuck. That flew, yeah, that shit was crazy, you feel bro. Me? Right, like that shit was crazy. That one too? Yes, that one. yeah, man. This bro, girl. everybody posted it, right? <laughs> yeah, I told this girl, I said, "Yo, you want to do a video?" She said, "What I gotta do?" I said, "Meet me at the airport." <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, I said, "Meet me at the airport, man." We did that video. We drove around, did the video in like what ten minutes. 
Really? Like, yeah, that shit was crazy, mm-hmm. bro. Like, I posted that shit. Because, man, that's, that's a real scenario, bro. Like, a lighter, my if a girl, if you fly a girl out, yeah. you expect the cheeks, bro. Um, Yeah, what the fuck? Like, I done flew you out and you don't want to fuck? Like, hold on. Like, yeah, I would be upset. I would be And then you got people upset, arguing, bro. like, girls be arguing, well, he should have knew what they were going to do before they got there. And just because a nigga flew you out, I mean, I give you no know, pussy. Yeah. Like, you got people arguing and shit. Like, this shit is a, 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 a known rule. Uh-huh. If a nigga fly you out, you got to fuck. Nah, yeah. man, hell nah. Bro. Yes, the fuck you do. No, no I'm saying, not, not you. Not if a nigga fly you out, you ain't gonna fuck <laughs> nah, you. Nah, 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 nah. But I'm saying like, yeah. If a, you fly a girl out, she is gotta fuck you. That's or, a written rule. Or what if she lives? You know, let's say you know, like a five hour like find a way, and you just want to spend time with her, so you are offering to fly her out. Do she still have to fuck? Man, why would you, bro? I mean. If you fly a girl like you want to fuck, you going to fuck? Well, I don't have sex until marriage, so I'm the wrong one to ask. You I a virgin? No. No, no, but, no, but. <laughs> Hold on, bro. Don't get started The last now. four Hold years. On. No, tell the truth. Hold on. Where you, so why are you ain't having sex? <laughs> so so uh, the last four years, me and my girl sort of have journeyed into our, like. Uh, so you got a girlfriend, you ain't fucking her? No. For four years now. Hey, hey listen. Man, she getting some dick, bro. Hell nah, man. <laughs> she getting some dick, bro. I'm telling you right now. She a virgin. Bro, she ain't no virgin. She lying to you. And maybe. That's right? what I'm saying, bro. She getting and some she dick. Is she Nigerian or something? She, is she no, she's African, she from... but... Okay. Yeah, she definitely getting some dick, bro. Man. Well, wait, <laughs> the right, right here, right here, right here, right? <laughs> Them bags that sound like bongos, bro. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, like, well, like, she's kind of thin, though, so... Uh, I don't, yeah. That shit sound like snare drum. Damn, bro. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> Question, though, right? So, look, right? So, look. So, those videos got to be paying, right? Because... Hell I just yeah. found out that fucking um that like uh oh my god yo like 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 just hilarious ex boyfriend like what's the name of you? Uh, Chris, what nigga? Chris? No like Chris? man, no no oh, man. Country no. Wayne? Yeah, Country Wayne. Oh yeah. So he paid two hundred thousand dollars a month in child support. Hell yeah, that's too man, that's too much. I mean, yeah, this nigga got a whole ass. Orphan. Dude, like, that's too much. Do y'all believe that though? Man, I believe it. He don't be lying. Two hundred k a month in child support. God, got like eleven k. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nigga, what? Oh yeah, the Rolly. Oh. Damn! <laughs> and courtesy of Facebook. Hey. Yeah. Shout out Facebook, on, yeah. hey. Snapchat. <laughs> you know God damn! Hey, snap, you make money on Snapchat too. Really? You ain't got no Snapchat show? No jumper dude, but I don't. Uh, you, bro, okay. listen though. They're making a bag. Dude. I just hit a hundred k and on YouTube, man. How do I get my my own my own Snapchat show, man? Man, you got to holler at the plug. Who? Man, we talk about that after the show. Wait, wait. And they pay you like what per month per video? What it takes them sixty days to pay you, but they pay you after that per view count or what? It's like based on like impressions, like how many people come watch your video and stuff. Yeah, like it's like it's a, it's a weird setup, but you get paid though. Damn, I don't get on to the analytics shit, bro. I just like I get paid. <laughs> Damn, I do the video and get paid. So you have four kids, right? Yeah. So how have you avoided child support? Like how did you like get custody? Man, shit, bro, like. My baby mama kept asking for money. I was like, man, quit asking for money. If you're going to keep on asking for money, like, send it to me. Because she's asking money for dumb shit, bro. Like, like she need money for My baby mama called me for everything. Food, bro, like, every, every, every single thing. She yeah, ain't got haircuts. nothing on nothing. Like, she ain't got nothing on nothing. That's crazy. She's trying to let, like, I done bought her a car and everything. Like, really? Go a car, go drive. She done got the car stolen and shit. Like, <laughs> man. Damn, like, in Kansas City? Yeah, man. I God, bought her a car. Man. And then when I bought her, when I, bought, when I, bought my first, when I got my first uh, YouTube check. Yeah. I was like, all right, I'm leaving yeah. Kansas City, okay. and you ain't got no car. I'm going to buy you a car. Yeah. I bought her a motherfucking car. Bro, tell me why the next day I see the, I got her the car the next day, I see her boyfriend driving that motherfucker, <laughs> smoking weed. He got the car all lit back like uh, that. Uh, uh, oh, that nigga cooling, man. I'm like, nigga, that's my uh, shit. That nigga having fun. Then nigga, then, then when they broke up, he stole the car. Oh, uh, he kept it. I got the car, nigga, hey, bro, bring the car back, bro. Yeah. Like, it ain't your car, I bought that motherfucker. You better <laughs> nah, bring that motherfucking crazy. car back. <laughs> like, man, bro, that, wait, bro. that seemed like a hassle. You just, so huh? you just got the one baby mom? Huh? You just got the one baby mom? I got mom? two. Okay. What? I got, I got two. I got one. She's a uh, she's an alcoholic. You know what I'm saying? So, wait. So, you was fucking like, like the worst type of women then? Man, bro. They would, See, my first baby mama, she was, she wasn't like, they wasn't, it seemed like, it seemed like her. I fucked up with her. I ain't gonna lie. I fucked up with that one. Why? Because, man, bro, I had, had no pussy for a long time. And I had the wrong vision goggles. Yeah. You know, I yeah. had the wrong, you know, I had no pussy in the wild, boy. You was like, well, let me just get was something Was the ass quick. fat or, or what? It wasn't none of that, bro. She just looked a little cute, little dark little chick, dark chocolate little, yeah. you know what I'm saying? She was decent. She was decent. She was, At yeah. that time, she was decent. 
You know what I'm saying? Wait. Like, so your standards have upgraded now? Like you now rich is way rich. higher than it was. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, no, 15 years ago, bro. <laughs> but, like, but that's nothing. See, 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 <laughs> see, 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 hey, see versus listen. The fame be changing niggas, man. For real, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Like my baby mama was they, 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 they ain't. My second one, she was cool looking. She was she was nice. Like niggas yeah. was, like, they would wanna fuck her. But she started Word. drinking, now she an alcoholic. Nobody wanna fuck with her now. Like she crazy Word? as hell, bro. Like she crazy. She thinks she like she called me that time. I'm 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 rapping now. She's on that kick the sneak and shit, you know what I'm saying? Oh, oh wait. <laughs> oh nah, is that bad? Bro, the drinking. How bad is she though? Like men in life, for example, are they like so like so like off looking that like you'll be embarrassed to like post them for like mother's Man, day? I ain't posting my baby mama's never. Damn. Mm. On no Mother's Day ever in my life, bro. What? <laughs> I ain't posting them ugly motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> they scraggly as a motherfucker. Yeah. I ain't supposed to do. They, wait, they are that scraggly? Man, they scraggly. Oh, yeah, fuck them. Let me see them, man. Come on, man. Show me. You want to tell my mama's man? Hold yeah, on, nah, <laughs> man. Right, because, <laughs> right? You too rich right now, yeah, probably. Bro, feel me like, crack, bro. I'm trying to tell you, bro. They gonna watch this shit. They be mad as shit. Yeah, right. Feel me like, you feel <laughs> me like. They watch this shit. I told them themselves. <laughs> feel me? And they finna say, Gerald is on no jumper talking down yeah. on his feel me like child uh, support. Uh-huh. Hold on, see if she pull up. Okay, here go the first one right here. This nigga got the kids. How are they gonna <laughs> scream child support? Hey, <laughs> hey, listen. If they go back and try to get custody, you feel me? And then my uh, my baby mama boys, my you this one know. right here, she got yeah. bad luck. Her last two boyfriends died. Really? Mm. Last two of them, shit. Oh, you, oh, you was lucky you for leaving her, bro. I made it out. <laughs> last two of them niggas did. Now here they go right here. See, they go the first one right there. Oh, come on, Gerald. Come on, nah, come on, Gerald. I mean, I got a couple like that. I got a couple like that. What? To the left. Yeah, I got a couple like that. That's fine. Come on, Gerald. Like, she big, though. <laughs> <laughs> so what? They need love, too, man. Picture, hey, he's picture. skinny as fuck. That's how it be, man. Quick, hold up. He lost weight, though, right? Yeah, lost weight, yeah. Yeah, like, oh, come on, Gerald. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Wait, uh, is that your son? Yeah. Bro, he looks exactly like... like his mom, like it's not even like like right like 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 right like that's fine right like like that's all his mom like like really? none of you like it's all his mom. He looked yeah, he acted like her too. Wait wait hold up, bro. So you got two big two big two big ones. No, nah, this this one right here, she 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 ain't like real big, but she big enough. That's crazy. Let me find the other one. Hold on, man. Is yours hard. big? Nah, I got, nah, I got her block. Nah. I can't even know if I can find her or not. Hold up. But yeah, I definitely, uh, I definitely ran into some big ones. She might be you, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, yeah, you know. Man, yo, that's how it goes. It's like the starter hose or whatever. Pro, when was the last time like you fucked a big girl? It's been some years. Yeah, man, we ain't gonna find another one. I got her blocked. Yeah, man. She hey, she hey. Hey. She <laughs> nah, wait. So you have up? Okay, so well, it's at, not upgrade. I just been with my girl what, so long. I ain't been, you know. what I mean, at what stage though? In, in like, in like y'all lives though? Like, did y'all say? I can no longer fuck fuck on big holes. Yeah, hey, you feel me? She blocked her. Right? She blocked. No, I blocked her. Oh, that's no, fine. she blocked. Where'd yeah, you stop the right. fucking big bitches though? Me? Yeah. Uh, man, I never really like fuck big girls like that for real though. No. Like my baby mama got big out there. She had the kids and shit. Yeah. You know, I mean, one time I did fuck this big girl. Mm-hmm. Uh, I met her at my brother's wedding. My brother got married, and I met his girl at the wedding. She had a, she didn't look that big. She had a girdle on and shit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, damn, yeah. she kind of. <laughs> She cool though. She nice looking. You know what I'm saying? We get in the motherfucking bedroom, take that girdle off, all this fat just roll out and shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, yeah. yo, you gotta turn around. You feel me? Like, I can't, yeah. like I ain't about to fuck you face up. You know you what I'm saying? Gotta turn around. Yeah, you I told, told this bitch to turn, yeah, turn around. around. I'm like, we oh, can't do nothing face up. You know what I'm saying? Like, nah, sad. that's nuts. God damn it. Wait, and why are you currently? Do you, fuck, do you get on top of your girl when you fuck? We like we like we like we we like don't have sex. You no, know I'm saying when you do fuck her. When yeah, you, yeah, you going for you gonna get on top. Yeah, yeah, right. Well, you gonna, you gonna kill it, bro. Nah, nah. <laughs> listen, hell nah. You feel me? Well, hey, well, wait, here, right, here, 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 listen. And hopefully, I, I lose some weight by then, right? You feel me? Right? You yeah, don't get on top of her, bro. Nah, man, she's uh, <laughs> nah, they like, they like that, bro. bro they like, built for it. No, she's not thin, thin. You feel me? Right here, let me see. Like, <clears throat> like, she's thin but not thin, thin, right? To where like I can like break her or suffocate her. Oh, okay. You feel me? Like she's a. Uh, She's like medium size, right? Her, 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 let me find a full body picture. Right? He said full body. We gotta find them full bodies, boy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. You feel me? Uh, you feel me? Yeah, you, you, yeah. Look. Uh, yeah, look. Uh, you know, like you know, like she's medium size. 
Oh yeah, she cool. So you was never fucking fat hoes. You ain't hit that. Nah, but not yet. And you lying like a motherfucker. She, she, she fucking. Nah, but not yet. She, you know I'm saying she yeah, fucking, yeah. not you. <laughs> hey, you ain't never. <laughs> oh, wait. So you ain't never fuck no big girls, huh? You just went. Oh, uh, I'll be real, bro. Like I don't think I, I ever fucked a big girl. Feel me? Like, you know, you, you know. Can't. What's, what's your How body you count? What you you got a low ass body count? Nah, man, not nah, hair. So uh -huh. I would say my body probably, count, bro. Uh, early thirties, probably like thirty one, thirty. Okay, that's oh, okay. Yeah. What about yours? Like, I, you, like what? It's probably the same. Yeah. Stop yeah. it. Low key, I, low key, I made a list the other day and shit. I was just going. Crib, you bullshit, my nigga. Then you yeah, made a nah, list, bro. It was like, yeah, I made a list. That's, yeah, that's some lame shit. But it's only for me, you know. what I mean, you bullshit. My little list. Yeah, no, it's like early thirties, bro. And you. What man? Um, this dog got crazy. more than by both y'all. <laughs> yeah, it's going crazy. What? Uh, an embarrassing amount. Uh. An embarrassing amount. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, nah, he getting it, bro. Five hundred plus. This dude said five hundred. Yeah, I don't know, man. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, that's crazy. I don't know. I don't know, bro. You going crazy, hey? Be bro, careful, here, counter, bro. bro. Yeah, be careful. No, you gotta wear condoms, bro. You definitely yeah, wear no, condoms. No, bro. Bro. Yo, bro, why are you in on and on probation? On probation, bro, because I got I got DUI. Oh, in, really? In Georgia. Man. Speak on that though. Man, cause okay, check this out. Like, so I live in LA for two years and I got these kids now. So I'm like, yo, let me go to Georgia, get a bigger space, you know. Mm -hmm. And bro, I'm I went to do the interview with uh off the porch. And I was smoking weed the interview. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, I was smoking weed the interview, so on my way back. My whole car smelled like weed. I got pulled yeah. over. Mm. And the cop was like, yo, it smell like weed in here. Get out the car. Blah, blah, yeah. blah, blah, blah. Took me to jail. That's that For easy, weed? Yeah. For that weed, easy? bro. Yeah. In Georgia. Georgia. Is crazy. Yeah, yeah, bro. That's a slave state. A fact, true. I hate Georgia, bro. Like, I lived, I've been living there for a year. I'm ready to come back to LA. I hate Georgia so much. I said, I can do Wait, more. you, like, you want to come back to LA? Bro, I hate Georgia, bro. Bro, LA sucks. LA. No, LA is fire, bro. Compared to LA is fire. Bro. You don't places. like LA? It's heavy traffic, no parking. The same thing in Atlanta. A world. Oh, the Negroes done mass migrated to the to the <laughs> urban right, bro. right. Like no, here, bro, here, bro. Because places like Georgia and like the Midwest, like you know, is not densely populated. But but right. like, I, I'm assuming what Atlanta now is like like mad populated now, bro. There's hella people there, bro. It's That's crazy. Twenty four seven, bro. It's just, it's just like L. A. Mm -hmm. Damn, and. And there's no parking? Man, you really can't find parking. You park in the wrong spot, your car can get a boot. You know what I'm saying? Just, just like LA, it's the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. like LA is like, I think maybe just like a Atlanta probably just a little bit. Man, I don't know about it. It's, it's too much traffic in Atlanta, bro. And too many goddamn trees. No, right? <laughs> yo. Trees everywhere. Yo. Wait, yo, listen. Why did you. So, oh, here. So, was this a Young Fly video before? <laughs> Or after the death announcement, the DC video. Yeah, was that before his wife passed away, or 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 after? Uh, it was after. Now, passed away. now, hey, hey, put me on. What happened? Now, hey, DC, now, hey, you. use a cold nigga for that, man. <laughs> see now, bro, that's that's crazy. Hey, right. Like, hey, hey, wait, no, when it first happened? Yes. Like, okay, I seen DC. Forget down right? Yeah, I see DC at the mall, and I'm like, oh, I got my glasses on. Like, oh. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna call him Chris Tucker. So I'm like, oh my God, it's Chris Tucker. I seen that one. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> and then like, he got super pissed. Mm. He got really, really mad. And so oh, when, he got, like, when he got really, really mad, it was kind of like, I was like, damn, I didn't think he was gonna get that mad. I think he was. Gonna, I thought he was gonna like probably laugh it off. We mm. probably seen the video before. Mm -hmm. Just laugh it off. Yeah. <clears throat> he didn't do it. He yeah. got super pissed. So I was like, damn. I'm not even posting this video. I'm not gonna post this shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I'm not gonna post. He this was video. mad. Like, he probably he's still. He probably still mourning over his uh, uh, baby mama or yeah, wife. Yeah, I'm not yeah. sure. If he, I'm not sure if baby mama or wife. I think it's just his baby mama. Not yeah, sure. he was but he's probably still mourning. I'm like, damn, that nigga was really, really. He never really, posted the video. Really I could have swore I saw no, it. No, I posted okay. it. I posted it, bro. Cause yeah. I posted it like two and a half months after that happened. Of course, okay. you know okay. what I'm saying. So like, uh, and I, I told him I was like, yo, bro, like, like, bro, I do videos. After the video, I'm like, yeah, I do videos. Yeah. I'm on tour with Funny Marco, blah blah blah. Yeah. And so like, I get, I, I leave Lennox Mall, and he must have he called Marco. Mm -hmm. up. I was like, yo, he was mad at first. Called yeah. Marco like, man, why you run up on me, man? And stuff like that. Like he was talking to Marco like really pissed. Yeah. And then Marco called me like, yo, DC mad, bro. You ran up on him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He don't know you. you ran up on him. He's fucking pissed. Of course. And then Marco called me back. I was like, yo, DC said post a video. Oh, really? So I was like, 
man, I don't know if I want to post that video or not. Of course. Because, like, he was super pissed. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, But, though, like, like, as a person in this space, right? Yeah. Like, and, and he got a bunch of, like, attention and praise, right, when he, like, punched a dude and on stage. Right, 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 right. So that video, though, of him, like, low-key, you know, like, being ready to fight— and he probably like shit. Hey, listen, man. Feel right? Like that makes me look good. Yeah, yeah. He, he was like posted. He he like, posted yeah. the whole video. Don't cut nothing out. Yeah, of course. You know what I'm saying? So like, yeah. I posted the whole video. Mm -hmm. The only part I cut out, and I was like, uh, it was a part of the video. I was like, yo, when I said, yo, I'm going to tour with Funny Marco. I cut that part out. You oh, got you. He was like, I cut that part out, and then, uh, and then, uh, like, like he was like, like he wanted the video post because I, I believe that he wanted to. Like you said, he wanted to appear that he was tough. a tough guy. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. DC tough. Well, yeah. I'm not saying DC's not a tough person because you know what I'm saying where he's from, he's from the west side of Atlanta. Of course. Uh I've heard things about him. I heard that he ain't he don't, you know what I'm saying? He's a tough nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. yeah, like he ain't like that. But like at the end of the day, bro, like I ain't no bitch either. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like yeah, of course. It's the same thing. Of course. And I think like like for me, like it like I didn't really think about the part that his wife passed away. When I did the video, I wasn't thinking that shit. I was thinking, like, oh, DC, yeah. go prank him. Mm -hmm. He probably gonna laugh. Because mm -hmm. a lot of people see my videos, bro. Like, I prank. I got Kevin Hart. He already knew who the fuck I was. Of course. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, so I walked to Kevin Hart. He was like, yo, what's up, Gerald? Before I even got to call him the wrong name, he already knew who the fuck I was. He said, yeah, I seen you when you walked in. Yeah. You know, I haven't posted that video yet. Oh, and, uh, a word? Yeah, I ain't posted the video yet. Oh, I got damn. a video of Kevin Hart. I got Kevin Hart called him Eddie Murphy. And that's so, right. like, <laughs> and crazy nah, that's like, like, when I seen Kevin Hart, I tried to go dress up as an African. I tried to disguise myself as an African. So I put an African, like, yeah. suit on and shit. Oh, damn. And, like, had on some sandals and shit. And I tried to prank Kevin Hart. You already knew the fuck you I was. I was like, damn, I'm like, damn, fucking. fucking. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's fine. But when I seen Ke uh, DC, I wasn't expecting, like, that reaction. I was like, maybe he's seen my videos before. Of course. He probably gonna laugh at all. Like, dude, you fucking silly. Yeah, of course. Like a lot of celebrities do. You know what I'm saying? Like, and only Chopper laughed it off or he wasn't? Yeah, he didn't laugh it off. And then I was like, yeah. I was thinking like, man. Cause I, bro, honestly, yeah. for me with death, it's crazy because like the last two years I lost my dad. Damn. My brother. Damn. And my closest cousin. Damn. Damn, bro. But you know what? They wasn't popular. So nobody knows. That's true. Them motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's true. DC's baby mama was popular. Nah, Everybody know her. You know what popular. I'm saying? Yeah, no. So I wasn't thinking in my head, like, you know what I'm saying? Of like, course. I got my own shit going on. So I'm not thinking yeah. in my head, like, if I go I up and hug this man. Bro. Of course. He mourning with his wife. I'm thinking he's in Lennox Mall walking around shopping and shit. Nah, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, for, for, like, I wasn't thinking, like, I wasn't thinking, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. And, like, did you guys, like, so after, like, y'all, like, shook hands, he said, all right, cool, cool. Like, what was the conversation next? Like, like he just left? He just, like, after that, it was just like, you know what, crazy? I met DC when I first started doing videos in Kansas City. Oh, really? I took a picture with him and everything. Yeah. He still didn't remember me. You know what, what I'm saying? Like, what, it, what, I know, I, know I, cut my, I cut my hair. I had dread. I had long dread. Yeah. I cut my hair. Yeah, so you know what I'm saying? I don't know if that was what it was or what. But when I posted DC uh, video, um, I, got, I ended up getting a DM from Mike Epps. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> okay. Because I, I don't even know how I pranked Mike Epps before. I caught him a little Duval oh, a while back. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> yeah, of course. So Mike Epps called me. He was like, uh. He's like, dude, you ain't gotta do that. Yeah. You ain't, I said, I seen your stand up. Your stand up was good. Facts, like of you course. funny as hell. It's like you ain't gotta do that, bro. Of course. Like, you can just do stand up and start to a podcast or something. Like you ain't gotta walk on with celebrities and call them the wrong name no more. You ain't gotta do that shit. Of no course, more. yeah, of course. He was like, man, I really want you to do your stand up. Of you know, course. So Mike F told me to do that shit. So I'm like, man, nah, that's why I ain't posted to Kevin Hart yet. I'm like, man, Uncle Mike said don't do it no more. <laughs> bro, wait. How do that feel as a comedian when Mike Epps and Kevin Hart knows who you are? Bro, like, that's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Like, bro. Um, it's a great feeling. Like Kevin Hart, the top dog, knows who the fuck I am. Of course. Mike Epps called me, one of my idols, calls me and tell me that my stand up is good. Yeah. I'm like, bro, I might not need to do this shit no more. He said, God told him to call me. That's what he said. He said, God told me to call you. Man, yeah. when, when, man, when man, listen, that man, I, man I, I, listen, man, I'm, <laughs> listen, I only buy that bullshit, my that nigga. nigga drunk or something. <laughs> but, hey, so, who were some of your earlier influences? Like some Mike Epps, or, um, you know what I mean? Who were you watching when you were Mike younger Epps, or whatever? Dave Chappelle. Uh -huh. oh. I met Dave Chappelle too. I got I pranked him, called okay. him Michael Jordan and shit. So, like, where you be? You just be? We got a celebrity map or whatever. Bro, you just like, be random. I be in the right what? places at the right time. That's always, crazy. bro. Like, always, how do you find it? Like, do I just seen uh, Lil Boosie daughter out at the airport? Out at the airport, and she walked past me and shit. You know, Poison Ivy. Oh, yeah, okay. I sent her to the airport, bro. Like, I ain't fuck with her though. I'm like, man, I mean, yeah, yeah for, you know what I'm saying, but <laughs> bro, I be running, to, bro, I be running to them motherfuckers all the time, bro. It's so, just a coincidence. Sometimes I'll be at the right place at the right time, like, like BT Awards when I got in the lead chopper, yeah. bro. This is how I got him. So he walked into the, the private area where only the celebrities can go, like the high high power motherfucker can go yeah. in his little room and shit. Mm -hmm. He go in there, 
I seen them walking in with like 15 people. They holding cameras and shit. Yeah. They walking in. So I'm like, fuck it. I started walking out. Like I was with them and shit. Yeah. And somebody <laughs> said, who you? I was like, with them right here. <laughs> I know. I walked in. I got into the back, bro. When I got in the That's back. Crazy. I yeah. seen a lot of I seen, I got a lot of, I seen L.A. Chopper. Yeah, you be oh, wild, there. bro. Everybody's back there, but I just snuck back there, but I wasn't supposed to be back there, bro. <laughs> Yo, how do Lotto smell in, in person? It's like, 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 right? Like, uh, um, bro. listen, man, like, how delightful is it? Bro, Lotto smell like Jesus' mama. <laughs> yeah, but she's so cold, man. Well, Lotto yeah, is know, Lotto man. bad, bro. Bad in person, right? She or bad, bad in person, yeah. Crazy, she ain't bad as Sweetie, though. Sweetie the baddest. Nah, man, hell nah. Better than Lotto and Ice Spice? You tripping. Man, Sweetie is the baddest woman I ever laid my eyes on, bro. What? Sweetie's more cuter than Bro, I she seen is Sweetie, like bro. Sexy, I forgot what my name man. was, bro. She's the baddest woman you've ever laid eyes bro, on? Bro, I seen Sweetie. I turned to, uh, I was like, like uh, off a of life. I was like, she's like, what's your name? I'm like, Claude. <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> forgot his name. Bro. I'm like, nigga. Uh, what? <laughs> Sweetie's bad, bro. Sweetie, man? You, 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 hey, well, hey, bro, listen. Like, but, like, I don't see, like, how she's, like, like, Hey, right. What makes her like stand Lotto apart from the rest of them? Lotto fine too. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, it's all subjective. Lotto fine. You know Lotto I mean? is fine in a motherfucker, bro. I know, right? Feel me? But and she sweetie is, got wide hips. Woo, sweetie, bro. Well, hey, she's dating like a gangster now. Man, I don't care who she's dating. Uh, hey, <laughs> hey, it's YG. I met YG. Nigga shook my hand. They're like. Like, oh. shit back, nigga. <laughs> what? I mean, YG, when gave me the hardest handshake ever in my life, bro. I'm like, nigga, what? You know, I'm gonna get my hand back. <laughs> what was that, man? What was that? Uh, that's Donnie, man. So, wait, wait, wait. Let me see, man. Like, like, what else do we got to talk about left? Man? Oh, uh, yo, listen. Give me like your uh, opinion, man, on Bobby Altoff, because, because, because I feel like she jacked you Who? and Funny Marco style style of. Who you talking about? The white girl who did the interview with with uh, Funny Marco. I've never heard of her before. Bobby, uh, stop it, my nigga. No, I'm just, I've never heard of her. Man, stop it. She's, 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 she's new. She's very new. Nigga, you know? nigga, listen, listen, hey, listen, hey, bro, I ain't never heard of her, bro. Man, life. man, all right, bro. Yeah, listen, yo. Show me a picture of her. Man, listen, yo. Like, yeah, I've nigga, never heard of her. The white girl who did the uh, interview with Drake, she's like in the bed or whatever. And he, I've never seen that interview. They do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, I'm saying, show me a picture of her before. She, and the controller, man. Does she do interviews? Her, nigga, Bobby Altoff, nigga, with Footy Marco. Oh, that girl, that white girl. Yeah, yeah, you ever seen She that awkward girl. as fuck. What she feel like she, she did? What? That was Michael she Sarah. stole you a, a funny Marco like style of like comedy and interviewing and like back and forth. You feel me? Right? Man, like she stole y'all shit. shit, man. So, so one, how do you feel like? So, so how do you feel feel about like your style of comedy being being gentrified and, and taken to a new level? Uh, I mean, she did kind of. You know, still a funny Marco style with the interview and stuff like that. But that's hey, that's hey, look, that's black people folks. Girls too though. They invite everybody to the barbecue, bro. Like mm -hmm. they invite everybody to the barbecue, bro. Like I really feel like she really don't like us. Damn. Like I really feel like she really don't like us, bro. Like Hey, now like again, whenever she's uh, raw some niggas, but I said tore her ass up though. <laughs> you see, I see, no, see, I see, didn't, see, I didn't you see, see bro. No, 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 I said, no. I said but you thought that he was like. Though. He know about her. I mean, hey, you nah, know nah, I've yeah. heard of her. Okay, in fact, yeah. right? Yeah, right? Yeah, but I. Right. So why do you feel like she don't like 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 us? Bro, you can just kind of tell, bro. Like, you can just tell, bro. Like, she too awkward with the shit. Like, mm. like she, like, I don't like the fact that when she, I seen when she, remember she interviewed Offset, she was like, I don't know who you are. Like, yeah. hold on, calm down. Like, you can <laughs> troll, but it's a level of troll. Like, you know who the fuck Offset is. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's well, like, that's the this bit nigga married though, to Cardi B. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Hey, right, hey, hey, right. But like that, like, but like that kind of like falls into like her whole, you know, like her whole bit, right? Which is like, I'm super awkward, you know. I yeah. insult you like a little from bit. From the suburbs, type you of shit. Yeah, right. Yeah. I think that's her being genuine. I would rather it be that than like what? her do like no. a Iggy Azalea, do like a fake yeah. accent or whatever, like a black scent type of thing. You know what I mean? Like, nah, bro. I, I, nah, I feel like, like she's being genuine. So like, a lot of genuine. Though. A lot of people do call her the white funny Marco. They call her the white funny Marco. <laughs> yeah, do, right. Bro. They call her the have white you, funny Marco. Wait, so like, have you in life, funny Marco ever like talk like yo? We gotta like start going harder, like at this interview and shit, right? Cause she done came in. Yeah. Took I mean, our I've shit. I've never heard Marco say anything about it. No. You know what I'm saying? Like about her. Yeah. But he always talking about how we gotta go harder, just whatever. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But hey, listen, he never said about her. 
if listen, if I'm him, I'm pissed. Cause nigga, listen. Cause what well, no right I mean, here. Right. Still getting money, man. Yeah, he bro, she got money too. Bro, <laughs> bro, yeah. When you get money too, you man, you don't care, man. Yeah. Like she, listen, she got Drake before before Funny Marco. Like, like, how's that fair, man? How's that fair? fair? I mean, she white. in the game. She a lot white, of, though. Yeah, a she lot white. of shit don't be fair sometimes. She white. Man. You get, she you white, get, bro. You get used to it, bro. Yeah. Listen, right? Listen, but it, it, if Drake was attracted, listen, right? So Drake hit her up. Because he's yeah. seen the Funny Marco interview. Right. So you know that Funny Marco does the exact same style of interviews. Yeah. And you hit her up to go on her shit before his shit, and and his shit was more lit at the time than her shit? Man. Man, hey, hey, man, hey It's not on, fair, man. bro, but life ain't hey, fair. Hey, she man, white, come on, man. man. Right. White people, got to, they always got ahead of us all the time. You know what I'm saying? Like, Man. A white dude could do my videos right now. He gonna be on Jimmy Kimmel. Nah, you know? yeah, <laughs> hey, but he hey, gonna be on motherfucker Jimmy Kimmel. Boy, like, look at this motherfucker right listen here. Listen though, he invented this yeah. new style of video. Wait till like again though, like that's coming though, right? Because if you stop doing those those style of videos now, yeah. somebody is about to fill right into that uh, lane, my nigga. Do it like yeah, and I mean, it's yeah. over. It's a constant grind. Yeah, how do you? I was gonna ask you that. How do you like uh, like? Fight like writer, writer's block or like you ever get like creative blocks uh, where you just be in a slump, don't know what to do next? For us to like stand up? I mean, just either way, Anything, yeah, writing, like, yeah, just your no, skits. No, not really, bro, your... because, uh, like, you know, Biggie, right? Like, Biggie, they say Biggie wrote what he's seen around him. Mm -hmm. So it's the same thing for me, bro. You got the internet. Fuck. You got hella shit that's triggered your mind and mm -hmm. like, you know, oh, okay, inspire you by some shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So like, mm -hmm. You know, it's never like a writer's block because never? you all got the internet, bro. The internet is always going to inspire you for some shit. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Then if you got funny friends. Like, uh -huh. I got friends that are funny. And so I can call a friend up, talk to him on the phone for 45 minutes or an hour, and then come up with some material or something right there, all the conversation I had with him. Fuck. Okay. So, man, man. Yeah, I can't do that. I can't talk to a nigga on the phone and shit. That's what? weird. Phone? Why? Yeah, like, I don't know, for an like, extended period of time, man, like I got a phone I got, conversation. I got, I, got probably what? Like I got like one friend that I've known I for. I Over got 20 years. N wait, bro, like, I got, like, a, a bunch of people that I can, right? Here, right? Look, right? So, look, like, you called them for, for like, one thing, and then, yeah. you know, like, y'all just. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. Y'all got Talk. friends uh, I like playing 2K. Oh. Play 2K? Bro, I'm ass at 2K, but I'm a mad at <laughs> God, though. Oh, you asked to, you play 2K? Nah, I don't play 2K. I'm oh, trash. Okay. Yep. I was ranked 47 last year. Word. Damn. Yeah, 47. Oh, no. <laughs> How do you have time? Time to, no, 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 no. Hey, Rankins mm -hmm. has nothing to do with your win, with, with the win loss records. It's just, it, it, it's so random. Oh, it's no, it's so random. No, right? No, no, like, it's just how much you play. You feel me? Yeah. Right, like, right, like, right, 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 right. For example, I could go 5,000 yeah. and 10,000, right? Meaning, like, I won 5,000 games and lost 10,000, right? But I'll probably be ranked like number one, right? Right, because I be played. Like, yeah, you feel me? You yeah, I play a lot because like, but like, a lot of people quit. Yeah, I play a lot of games. Well, quit. Well, guess what? Now though, like that's actually like now like not a uh, a lot of more right. So two K now is like handing out like like a seven day ban, a thirty day mm -hmm. ban for like quitting mid game. Yeah, you feel <laughs> me? Yeah, sometimes yeah. Like, people be quitting, bro. Like. Especially like I don't know the first quarter of me, man. People be quitting. Mm. Man, stop it, bro. You that nice? You make niggas man, quit. Nice. Hey, man, stop it, man. I'm trying to get my <laughs> game up for this this new two K that came out. Yeah, I ain't getting a wrong play like six times. I ain't, oh, I ain't, oh, where? I ain't getting a wrong. You, you too game, busy, like, man. Game plays or huh? nothing. You too busy. I've been busy lately, bro. Like, I know. Last year, I was like, last year I was busy, but I wasn't as busy as I am this year. Yeah, man. This yo, year I'm real busy. Yo, yo, uh, your hair is too perfect. Yeah. <laughs> now, 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 hey, now maybe it, it, it's the hating African hairline and, and me, <laughs> right? But your hairline is too perfect. Yeah. The texture is too perfect. Hey, man, the barber's in Atlanta, bro. <laughs> is that a toupee, my nigga? Nah, bro, that's my hair, bro. It's my real shit. Nah, you can see it, yeah. It's, it's my, my real shit, hair. bro. You can see it, bro. <laughs> my shit perfect, bro. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> Wait, though. And you're, what, 36, 37? I'm going to be 34 in, uh, what's today? Nine days. So you're 34 years old. Yeah. Damn near 35. Yeah. With a perfect hairline and silky smooth waves and hair. As and because my daddy, man, my daddy wasn't like, had any of them and shit. Ah, that's probably why, though. Yeah. Right? I ain't full of black, bro. Ah, <laughs> uh, you feel me? All right, right? You feel me? Uh, okay, right? Yeah, right? 
Because if you would have came here as a blue brown Negro with yeah. silky hair, I would have said, "Hey, my nigga, like, what's the plug, <laughs> right, dude? right?" But hey, hey. And on that note, man, Gerald, we thank you for coming, man. Listen, man. Hey, much love, man. Yo, hey, listen, Gerald is going to be back with Kenny soon. Kenny Brooks, yep. And I'm working on a dating show right now. I'm about to do a dating show. Okay. N- wait, no. Um, I, I, I seen, see, listen, you are inconsistent with that, though, right? Because <laughs> I seen, I seen like, the bad dating show. Yeah, bad date. I watched, like, every episode of it. Yeah. And then, and then one day you just stop. And I don't want to do bad date no more. I mean, I'm doing something else right now. Word, what? Yep. What, like an awkward dating show? Like a Bobby Altoff themed dating show? Nah, like, <laughs> <laughs> right? No, nah, not, not, like, not like Bobby, bro, but uh, I can't really get into too much specifics of it because we're mm. we trying to pitch it to some networks. Niggas shit. still shit too, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah niggas trying to tell you shit. Like, yeah. I heard you going to know jokes. Let me hear him do it real quick. Yeah, 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 right? Like, what the, you know what I'm saying? So like, uh, we working on a dating show. show. Yeah. It's like starring you pop, or what? Me, bro. Like, well, not well. I'm gonna host it. I'm hosting a dating show. Mm. And have couples come on my show. You know what I'm saying? All right. So, hey, listen. I don't man. get too much detail, but we're doing a dating show right now. Yeah. Hey, listen, man. We will be staying tuned, and then afterwards, man, you got to tell me about the Snapchat plug, guy. Right? Oh, y'all tell you about that shit, bro. No yeah. problem, man. Man, folks. Hey, 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 man. Like, sub, subscribe, man. Comment, man, and, and follow Gerald Houston. Yeah, follow him on Instagram at I am Gerald Houston. Yep. And on Facebook, Gerald Houston. Yep. And everywhere else, Jerry Houston. Type it in, you'll see it. Man, folks, man, peace out, man. Peace.